Hello guys and welcome back to Get Set Python. In previous two videos on Word Cloud, we saw how we can prepare our own Word Cloud. But you can see that this Word Cloud is nothing more than a plain rectangular box. And in this video, we'll see how we can give this Word Cloud some beautiful shapes to make it look more attractive. So here I have two masks with me that I'll use in this video. So the first one is a cloud mask. As you can see here, this will give cloud shape to our words. And the second one is Twitter mask. You can download these from Google itself. So without wasting any time, let's see how we can do this. So when we first installed word cloud library we also downloaded pil and we will use it as well as we will use numpy that we downloaded at that time so now except text we can use one additional thing that is mask to add different shapes to our word cloud so the syntax is np.array image.open and in here we'll pass the file name that is our mask here so first one was saved as cloudmask.png and you can store it in any variable that you want and then we have to pass it here so mask is equal to okay let me change this so it will give you a better idea our mask we can keep it mask if we want but just to make things clear I have named it our mask so let's see how it works so if you look closely we've got our word cloud in shape of a cloud here and just to make things more clearer, I'll also demonstrate the Twitter mask. So all we have to do is change the file name. And here you can see that we've got our own beautiful word cloud having mask of Twitter bird. So that's how we can use different masks to create different shapes and different word clouds so that's it for this video guys see you in the next video with some another topic related to python till then stay tuned bye bye and have fun with python